What's up everybody? I am playing SCP Containment Breach. Now, if you do not know what this is, SCP is Secure, Contain, Protect. A facility designed to contain, you know, things like, uh, in the bottom right corner is SCP-173, I believe, a statue that basically this game is about at first. 173 is, if you look at it, it does nothing, but if you blink, turn away, if you remove your eye uh, contact with it, it can move around, like, teleport, basically, and will get behind you, teleport behind you, and snap your neck, meaning you're dead. <laughs> so, this is a very scary game. Uh, if you want to look up more there about SCP, there's a whole website that contains every single SCP, and I'm gonna go ahead and start this, um, I, I, there's no audio in the game, I can't figure out a recording device that will do that, so, if y'all can think of one, send me that, and I'll check it out. Anyways, I'll do Aaron, oh, and also these, the maps are randomly generated, so, whatever you find, okay, so, SCP-513 is an unremarkable rusty cowbell. Oh. Roughly one hour after exposure to any noise produced by SCP-513 exposure victims begin to catch glimpses of an entity designated as SCP-5131. Hmm. Anyways, um, so in this facility, I mean this is a newer version of the game, so in the facility there's like guards and stuff, and I'm a D-class personnel. Basically I'm a guy that you know, got out of jail. <laughs> they they bring in test the test subjects or people from jail. So I'm D class personnel nine something. I don't care. And I'm gonna be testing or e entering the chamber of one seven three. That's the primary goal at the first start. And you'll see what happens later. It's pretty scary. I wish I had the sound because it's lots of ambience noises in this game. That's <laughs> pretty cool. Pretty cool. Loading. I, I kind of want to face cam too, but I'm not going to do that. Hopefully, y'all will enjoy me visiting my pants in this video. I have played it lots of times with friends and stuff. We make like maps of the place. Okay, so on the bottom left corner is my sprint bar and my eyesight bar. Uh, basically, I press space and I can blink, and that's all fancy and stuff. Uh, before I start this, though, I'm going to do a little quick test. One second. Uh, I'm going to pause this recording and see if see if the fraps is working right. I could be, my screen could be flashing a lot. Okay, so there wasn't a problem at all. Uh, I checked it. There was not a problem. Uh, I'm going to have to go through this loading again. Uh, anyways because I've seen an earlier version where I recorded and it was like flickering very badly uh yeah so I, I, I watched the last little bit and yeah it's working fine um so basically if, if you saw that little part I w I'm in a room this is my cell chamber and I've got a little paper I don't think I have time to read it though because things start happening pretty fast right after you get in here I'm going to pause it and skip to the getting in part. Yeah. Okay, here we go. And, okay, so there's a note here. Uh, on behalf of the SCP Foundation and our staff, we welcome you to the exciting one-month working period in one of our top-secret research facilities. Unfortunately, the exact detail... We got some work for you. Please step out of the cell. Alrighty then. So, yeah, it's kind of still in the beta, so... We were authorized to kill disobedient test subjects, so don't try anything. Alrighty then. Uh, I can also crouch now, that's a new feature, so that's pretty good. Okay, so we're walking through the facility. Uh, I do want you to recognize what some of this looks like, because uh, for later you'll, you'll be able to see some of these types of rooms. See, so look up, oh, people down there. This reminds me of Half Life, it, it's Gordon Freeman. No, it's not Gordon Freeman, but uh. Okay. Here we are. 
go follow his instructions, blah blah blah. Okay, so you'll probably be fine. Of course it will. SCP-173. That's what he looks like. Uh, that's his profile picture, basically. Uh, Attention all Class D personnel. Please enter the containment area. Or chamber. And look at their awesome movement. It's so awesome. Oh my gosh, I'm getting slow frames per second. Holy crap, one second. Um, okay, I'm better now. I had to restart fraps for a second. Please approach SCP-173. Oh, door's opening. Uh, there seems to be a problem with the door system. The door isn't responding to any of our attempts to close it. Please maintain direct eye contact. Oh no. Uh. This door was previously previously locked. If you don't know. S Whoa. Okay. That hardly ever happens. Oh, I didn't save it either. Um, okay, that sucked. So I'm gonna skip the intro this time. Whoa, okay, that scared me. Okay, that never happens. Ever. I've never seen him kill you at the beginning. Oh, hey, now we know. Now we know we can. Yeah. Okay. It's scary, scary. Okay. Oh, look, there's a cheat. I'm not sure if. No, I, I think he is still enabled. There, there's a a guy that. Okay, I don't really want to say in case I see him. Because you know, I want y'all to be surprised. S SCP 106, very scary. I don't like him. Um. Yeah. So. All. Interrogations thus far indicate the SCP-5131 is a tall, immedicatal humanoid with abnormally large hands. Hmm. Interesting. The count bell. Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna save here immediately. Okay, open door. Close door. Gas mask. The gas mask is really important. Batteries. Side is it? Side is experiencing lots of containment breaches. I just heard a gunshot. Ah, uh, probably him. Yeah, see, look all the blood. Ew. I wish I could take his gun. Oh, I think this toilet's called the Whispering Toilet. It's actually an SCP itself. Let me hear if I can hear anything. Nope, I don't hear anything. Okay, so it's not the Whispering Toilet. Okay, so I'm gonna keep going. Oh, I don't like this. Ah. Yeah, that was SCP-006. Map C. Why does every map start like this? It starts like this every time now, I think. Okay, so SCP-106 is a humanoid figure that can go through walls. And basically when he does, he leaves corrosion in the wall. Basically like those spots, and I'm, I'm pretty scared of that, so... Oh. Um. Yeah. Uh, e. Which way should I go? Oh, this way. These rooms were really lit before, so... Oh. This game is so not as scary with friends. Ooh, I'm so scared. Oh, oh see that there's some corrosion, so he's been here before. Either that or he's gonna come here, I don't know. Uh, key card, where's it? Key card. Level two, good. Alright, level two is a really good key card. Ooh. You guys should get this game. It is amazing. It's not finished, obviously. It's kind of like Minecraft, where they just keep added, adding stuff to it. <gasps> There's an SCP. It's a rubber ducky. That teleports kind of like 173 when it's not in sight. But that one apparently doesn't want to teleport. 
Did it just... I heard, like, music. That was weird. Okay. Oh. Oh, I'm scared. Oh, I don't like this room. I'll go in it anyways, just for you guys. Oh, no, it's another one of these rooms. Oh, man, I haven't seen the SCP guy anywhere. I am lucky. Oh, I'm gonna put my volume down a little bit because I'm I'm scared. So, oh, oh here he is. There he is. He's in there. Look, see when I blink, he just moves. Oh, and I'm not sure the camera might not catch this, but every now and then there's a creepy face that'll appear on here, which is actually a virus, an SCP thing. It does that to cameras, I think. Uh, I'm not sure. I'll watch it till it does that. Look at that SC Oh! Oh, well, there it went. Okay, so... Basically, I have to run through this gas door thing without... Here I go. I don't know where he is. There he is. So don't keep looking at him. Get out the door. Close the door. Oh! Oh, okay. F5 save. Oh, what is this? Oh, this is a dead end. Oh no, the mon monsters have a large chance of spawning there. I just heard something. <sighs> like steps. But okay, they're gone. Ambience noises, they always freak me out. Especially. <laughs> No, don't. Oh, I opened the door, and then Blake, I uh, killed me. Well, uh, I guess I'll load it one more time. I don't know where I last was, so. <sighs> it's not scary here. Don't. Okay, I'm. I'm already here again. Okay, where is he? Okay, he's in the corner, so that's good. No, 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 not yet. I need to let. I need to get out of here. Uh, so he's right there. Wait, is he blocking the door? Okay, good. No. Oh! No, get through the door. Don't. Oh, no, I got locked in. Oh! Open the door, please. I'm dead. I'm just gonna quit now. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Oh, oh. That means noises. Every time you see him, you, go, you know, like every horror game. Oh, man, guys, play this with a friend. It's a lot less scary. We even make, like, maps of the facility so we don't get lost. It's, it's a lot better. I don't know why headphones just creep me out playing horror games. I, I can't handle it. If if I'm doing it on speakers, ooh, it's a lot better, but headphones, guys. If you want to be creeped out, play this like I am at eight o'clock at night with headphones. Ooh. <laughs> SCP six A two must be destroyed as soon as possible. It's a big giant lizard that could destroy the whole facility, but I don't think you can see it at all in the game right now. Uh, last thing I saw was that he was protected by some guards. I don't know. Oh man, this this is fun. F no, it's not fun. Okay. I'm blinking. Where are you? Are you are you even in there? I think he's in that doorway right there. Yes, he's just like camping right there. Do something. I don't want to walk through there with you camping on the door. Yeah, I think I see him like yeah, I see him right there, he's just like spazzing out. Whoa. I hate that MP that SCP. I mean I like him because he's like the least scary, but <sighs> blinky blink. Blinky blink at the door. Is he not there anymore? I'ma just try going through. Leroy Jenkining. 
Where is he? <gasps> oh, I forgot the door's timed, so I gotta hurry. <sighs> See, it's less scary the more you play it. Good job, Aaron. I've been through that room, like, 300 times over the past... Okay, he's, he's in a good position. Oh, I guess I thought he was somewhere else. Because <laughs> I, I went in there and immediately died because I wasn't looking at him. Whoa! This must be a SCP type. that You need to trust it. That's what it says. Like, it's spazzing out, but it does say you need to trust it. That is freaky. Okay, where is he? Oh, there he is. Keep running. Keep running. Door closes. Door closes. Safe. I can take off my gas mask. Safe. Oh, lordy. There's a device that can tell you if he's close. Oh, I'm not. Here. One second. Blink. Save. Walk through. Because he could appear on like on the complete other side of the smoke. That Oh, this room. Oh, I heard something move. I heard stone scraping on other stone. <sighs> that makes me scared. Because he can open doors too, so... Hi, Ducky. You make me feel safe. Please be something in this room. Oh, thank the Lord. Oh. Yes. Yes, but I don't... Oh, yes, I do have a keycard. I hear something moving, so I'm going to open this door real quick and get in. This is an SCP. Um, close. I don't... In case something, you know, tries to get in, they can't. Okay, this SCP... If you can read this, it says you can change it rough, very fine. It. This is the input. You put something in there, so I'm going to put... Uh, my gas mask, see how... You put on the gas mask, it says that right now. But if I drop it in there... I will change it, I'll make it very fine. Activate it. Oop. Activate it. You get a gas mask. But it says, you put on the gas mask, it feels as if it's easy to breathe better than normal. And now if you look at your sprint, the sprint goes up pretty fast with the gas mask. Go back on. Even better with, than without. Oh, health kit. Uh, first aid kit. Why do I hear, like, st stepping or stone grinding? Okay. Uh, I figured out, don't make batteries fine, or super fine at least, because they will be so fine that they'll electrocute you, because they're so fine. <laughs> they got too much electricity. Okay, so master card, or this key card, is level 2. What I'm gonna do is walk into this one, drop the level 2 card, and save it, because there's a little... It's not really... Well, first, save it. Just in case. Drop the card in. And then, uh, change it to... Either fine or very... Fine will change it to a level 3 card. Very fine. Uh, kind of has some stranger effects. We'll just see what we get. And output. Let's see. Hopefully I get the right one. Darn it! It makes it a master card. If anyone gets this joke, it's it's a master card. Like, it's a credit card, but it says master cards. It's a, it's a, it's a kind of a joke. So I'm gonna quickly load my data again. Okay, I am back, and I took I got my save. So hopefully this time we'll set it very fine and activate. It. And we're gonna go ahead and read. Oh, I guess I already picked it up. The note. This note, as a reminder to all staff, no organic matter is to be entered into SCP-914 at any time. Please follow standard review procedures to re in regards to input both checklists to prevent any and all accidents. We do not wish to repeat the repeat of the spider slash steel wire incident of last week, Dr. Harp. Okay. Yes. Okay. So I got a key card omni so it's like basically level seven six card uh it's funny to put the note in let's put the note in and we'll make it a very fine note i think it'll be a very fine note oh what is this is this another no okay it's not 
just objects. <gasps> it's an origami! <laughs> it changes the notes into origamis. I found that funny. Very fine note is an origami. Okay, so last thing we should do is turn the first aid kit into. I actually don't know what this is going to do, so I'm going to just change it to fine. A fine first aid kit. Um, after this, I'm probably just going to go till I die, which will probably be right when I exit that door. Look at that. I heard a noise. Just small first aid kit. I don't know why it turns smaller, so. Breach Mary. So I'm gonna do F5 save. Requires key card. Well, I got a mess. An Omni card, so sick it. Okay, so. The last place looks like. Oh, wait, there's more this way. I forgot. Ooh, spooky. I don't think he. Ooh, that's corrosion, so. I don't think anything spawns in rooms you've already been to, so I'm I feel a little bit safe right now. I'm gonna say that, and then he's, something's gonna appear right in front of me. Oh, this room. This is another SCP, but look, the door's already open. So, object class Elucid. Uh, oh, I'm scared. Okay. Uh, there's no notes for this, but. Oh, yes, there is. Can I find it? I picked it up. Okay. Uh, this one's kind of scary. Uh, basically, it stays behind you the whole time, but you never see it. Or, like, it, it predicts your movement, basically. And you can kind of catch glimpses of it. Like, out of the corner of your eye, you'll see, like, you know, like, a weird thing, like, up here. That's, that's what I call this guy, the corner of the eye glitch. Or, not glitch, uh, thing... It's so like if I stand, th probably if I stand still a lot, you'll, and then you know, blink, you know, you'll, you'll see part of something. It creeps people out, including myself, because I think it's you know, something that's gonna kill me. But this guy, he's safe. He's behind me. He's behind me. He's, I can't see him because he's behind me. If I could have, like, a camera behind me, you'd see him. I guess. I don't know. But boom, he's not there because he predicts my movement and he's really like slender very thin and so he, since he predicts the movement he never gets caught it's kind of cool I think the idea I mean I'm pretty sure in reality coding wise he's not there but ah get on top anyways um, I think this will wrap up this little episode of SCP. I kind of don't want to proceed, so I think I'll just save it here. Maybe play it some other time. If you really like it, I'll play it some more. Peace, y'all. Yeah.